Hello guys, welcome to What V Want, a technology vlog. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create broadcast on WhatsApp. For more information, visit our article. Link provided in the description. Keep your kids safe online by tracking their WhatsApp activity using Hoverwatch. A free, easy to use, and highly effective mobile tracker. Link provided in the description. If you are new to our channel, click on the red color subscribe button and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Without any delay, let's get started. First, we need to know what is WhatsApp broadcast and its key features. What is WhatsApp broadcast? WhatsApp broadcast is a function that allows you to broadcast a message to several contacts at once without forming a group conversation. It's beneficial when you want to deliver the same message to multiple people separately while keeping responses private. Each recipient receives the message in their personal conversation with you. With broadcasts, you'll know who's on the list and recipients will get messages from you as long as they have your phone number and are on your list. You can eliminate this restriction by gaining access to the WhatsApp Business API, which allows you to reach out to an infinite number of consumers on WhatsApp. Key Features Private Replies People receiving the message can't see what others say. Each reply goes to a private chat. Contact Requirement Only contacts who have saved your phone number will hear the broadcast message. Time Saving It's great for sending updates to a group without needing to keep copying and pasting repeatedly. More engaging than group chats, emails, and SMS. Now let's see how to create broadcast on WhatsApp. Launch the WhatsApp application on your device. Tap on the three vertical dots at the top right corner of the screen. Choose the new broadcast from the options menu. You will be redirected to a new screen where you will find your contacts list. Pick the contacts that you want. You can use the search icon as well, at the top right corner, to search for a specific contact. Once done with selecting the required contacts, click on the green tick mark icon at the bottom right corner. That's it. The broadcast list has been created with the selected contacts. Now you will send the message in the broadcast list, but you will get the reply on individual chat. If you want, you can add more recipients, remove existing recipients, or edit the name of the broadcast list. For that, click on the three vertical dots at the top right corner in the broadcast list. Select the broadcast list info option. Otherwise, simply tap on the broadcast list icon at the top. You will be redirected to the new screen. There you will find the list of existing recipients. Go with the edit recipients option to add or remove recipients. Click on the untitled list to change the name of the broadcast list. And click on the broadcast icon to add an image to your broadcast. That's it. I hope you like this tutorial. For more information, visit our article. Link provided in the description. Subscribe to our channel for regular updates. And don't forget to hit the bell icon.